My name is Lance Meyer uh, with Case IH. I'm a region precision manager um, for Case IH and our specifically our South Central United States. So Kansas, Missouri, down to Texas and Louisiana. So fairly large territory, but I'm gonna talk a little bit about our new Field Ops web and mobile app today. I'm specifically focusing on the mobile app. So this is a new redesigned app from the ground up. We started from scratch working with farmers to create this new app. I'm just gonna dive right into uh, the actual details of the new app. So you'll see up here in the top left, I've got this overview. So this is the first thing a customer is gonna see when they come into their account. They're gonna see what equipment's moving in the field or if it's working in the field and what operation it's doing. So first off, you can see here, we've got a Steiger 580. That's actually out here in the demo area um, along with some other machines in our marketing account. But one thing I wanna point out here is that it tells you the operational status of the machine and what it's doing in the field currently. So you can tell uh, this machine has been moving for a minute and well, right about two minutes. Um, so moving means that it's field transit, it's not in work um, at that specific point in time. But we come down here to this and you can see it's green, which means the, the machine is in work. And then even below that, the key is on in this tractor. So key is on, engine's not running, that sort of thing. Another thing I wanna highlight here that's new with the Field Ops app versus AFS Connect is the real-time monitoring. So you'll see that this time keeps counting up about every two seconds. So that's pretty well real-time, two to five seconds. We're having that machine data update back here on the app. So underneath each machine, you'll see some random numbers that probably don't mean a lot to somebody, but to us, they're pretty important. So this number two is the field name. And then we've got what operation they're doing, how many acres they've covered, and then our quick fuel and def level. So when a customer opens up the app, they're gonna see a snapshot of their operation and what his machines are doing in the field at that point in time. Another thing that's new with Field Ops versus AFS Connect is this remote display view button over here. So that button on the far right, and I'm just gonna click into it and show you a little bit more, we've got this dual monitor button. So that's the remote display view. So new in the app, can remote display view the Pro 1200 display from your phone or tablet or however you have the app. Drilling down a little bit into more of the machine, we've got just regular machine parameters. So engine, transmission, um, field parameters, that sort of thing. So um, like I said, it's real time. So a customer can log in and see this, so what, what's exactly going on in their machines at any specific point in time. We also have this uh, location history. So that's a 24 hour period um, time and I can go back and see uh, where that machine was um, and look at specific points in time to look at um, machine parameters. Then the last one on the right over here is directions to, the, to that machine. So I can punch that in. It's gonna bring me back to Google Maps or Apple Maps and I can navigate to it. So that's a little bit on the machine side. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and navigate over to the farm page now. So we've got machine information and agronomic information coming off our machines at all times that's updating in here. Uh, I'm gonna find a good field here, click on it. And underneath each field, you'll be able to see every single operation, agronomic operation that's happened on that field. So I can click on each layer. It's gonna show me a map. And this was an actual prescription planting map um, that we sent out. So um, we send this directly out to a machine via our web platform and the customer is ready to go and plant that prescription in the field. So that's a little bit about field ops today. Um, if you got more questions, contact us here or visit your local Case IH dealer.